Cracking Windows User Passwords, presented by AVM Technology, LLC. For this exercise, we're going to use Kane to crack Windows User Passwords. Okay, the uh, Windows User Password file is located in the Windows directory under System32 Configuration SAM. SAM stands for the Security Accounts Manager file. So the first step is obviously we're going to start Kane. So you can see uh, the Kane interface has uh, several tabs. For uh, since we're cracking the uh, SAM file, we're going to use the uh, Cracker tab. We're going to uh, begin by going to File, Add to List, and we're going to see about important hashes from the uh, local system first. Hit Next, and this has all the uh, users in the system. So you can see uh, we already see some passwords here. For some accounts, the uh, password field has been left empty, so they have no password. The uh, next step is going to be we're going to start actually cracking the passwords for the other users. What we're going to do will be a uh, dictionary attack. So let's get all the accounts, right click, go to dictionary attack. And uh, by the way, a dictionary attack will just use basically a list of words to uh, try to guess the password from that list. So we're going to go with LM hashes. So you can see there is no uh, file here, which means there's no dictionary file. So we need to add a dictionary file. And for that, we're going to go to uh, Kane on the word list, and we're going to choose this file. So that should give us that one. Uh, the uh, options, I uh, can probably uh, keep the default. So let's make a couple changes here. And we can begin the attack. So you can see it's taking a little bit of time. So uh, we're going to pause here for a second and we'll be back when they uh, discover some of them. In the meantime, you can just uh, let it uh, go on its own. So after approximately one minute, we got a bunch of passwords already uh, cracked. In this case, there are 13 accounts on the computer, uh, 13 user accounts, and we got the uh, password for 10 of them. For the remaining three, uh, we're going to have to try a uh, brute force attack which basically uh, just means it's going to try all kinds of characters uh, that we will define until it finds a password. Some brute force attack, depending on the uh, strength of the passwords, may take a very, very long time. The uh, passwords that have already been uh, cracked, in this case there's the uh, three accounts that we were unable to crack, which are right here. So we're going to select those three accounts and then we're going to uh, begin the uh, brute force attack. So we're going to say brute force attack. going to choose LM hashes. Then here we're going to have to uh, select a character set. The uh, more characters you uh, use here, the uh, better the chances that the password is going to be cracked, but also it will take uh, longer to crack the passwords. In this case, uh, just uh, for this example, let's just go ahead and uh, and choose the uh, this one here with the uh, letters and numbers. And we're going to do the length between 1 and 7. And then we're going to begin the attack. Hit start. The, uh, in terms of the uh, time left, this number is going to vary. If it could go up to uh, 10 days, 20 days, even longer. The, uh, don't pay attention to that number right now. Just give it a few hours to uh, try maybe uh, two or three hours. In this case, I'm going to give it about three hours. 
and then we're going to co come back to it. So we're going to pause this for a second and be back in about three hours and see what happened with the uh, three remaining passwords. So about uh, an hour and a half or so later, you can see that all the password has, uh, passwords have been cracked. So uh, now when we look at the uh, username and password uh, list, we have all the uh, accounts that actually had uh, associated passwords uh, have been able to, uh, to be cracked. Uh, sometimes it may take a little more effort. In this case, the passwords were somewhat simpler. Um, And uh, actually, uh, Kane, uh, you can modify the settings, add uh, special characters and other methods. It might take longer to go through the uh, process, but uh, uh, this uh, th this can help you understand the uh, importance of uh, choosing uh, strong passwords and using different characters in order to keep uh, other users uh, from uh, using tools like Kane to crack your Windows password. Cracking Windows User Passwords, presented by AVM Technology, LLC.